welcome your faces. My name is Jamie, and today we are going to be doing something uh, a little different from yesterday just because. Uh, okay, we. <laughs> our audio messed up last time, and un unfortunately, I had to redub it. So hopefully, you guys enjoyed the redubbing. Um, man, it, 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 it was annoying, so you're welcome. Anyways, uh, today we've gotten flash from the main guy up there uh, we don't necessarily need to go in the cave that has it because there are no trainers in there I searched it um, so I guess all we have to do now is go in here well uh, it's time for our first gym badge oh gosh and I think we should probably battle all the people before Faulkner uh, just for extra experience, because Garfunkel, man, this is going to be Garfunkel alone. Not even kidding. Because um, Garfunkel is like level 13, 14 now, and all of my other Pokemon are either Grass type or uh, Bug type, which are not very good with uh, Flying types. See the Spearow, it didn't even die in one hit. I need to be able to kill all of these. Ah, uh, gosh. And I can't use potions in this? This is crazy. Okay, whatever. We're gonna get through it. We're gonna get through it. So now I got Bird Keeper Abe. And I got... And I sent some money to Mom. That's cool. Um, okay, well, this isn't as bad as I thought it'd be. Um, oh, before I forget, uh, another rule is that you cannot get... Um, you cannot catch any Pokemon in gyms, so, yeah, there's that. Um, since you're trying to beat the gym, gym league alone, I mean, you don't want to get disqualified from the gym league challenge, come on now. Ooh, I don't think we're ready for this. <laughs> okay, whatever, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it. And he's got another Pidgey. Come on now. Go. I'm going to bite this Pidgey and hopefully it's going to die. Uh, no, it comes to the yellow. I, did I do less damage to this one than I did the other? Holy crap, critical hit. Okay. Um, well, I'm definitely going to bite you. Yep, and it's dead. Almost level 15, which is actually pretty impressive. Um, for raising a freaking Rattata. Um... Yeah, so before we go and face Faulkner, I'm gonna go heal up at the Pokemon Center, and I will come right back. So, I'll be right back. Healing my Pokemon like I can. Watching my skin go by as I heal my Pokemon. She steals my Pokemon and puts them on the healing machine, knowing not that I stole them from previous people before. Now I take my Pokemon back and I put them in my pocket and my skin's not the same, but it'll be fine once I exit the Pokemon Center and go back to the gym league. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! Okay. <laughs> We're back. All right. Now, let's challenge Faulkner, because we can. Um, hopefully, I'm ready for this. I really hope that I'm ready for this. Uh, I'm going to be really sad if Garfunkel dies. Oh, man. I don't have, like, any rock types, and I don't have any electric types. Oh, this is going to be a pain in the ass. I can already tell. <laughs> okay, so here's Faulkner. Oh, my. And he sends out a Pidgey. Um, it's level 9, so it's not that big of a deal compared to the others, so I'm just going to use a Bite. Um, that t that's going to take it down to yellow. Um, I'm just going to try to use a Tackle, which is actually Stab, since Pidgey is half normal type. Uh, I'm going to try a Bite again, and I'm going to knock it out. Um, oh, gosh. Preparing for the next Pokemon. It's going to be a Pidgeotto. Uh, okay. Um... Yeah, I guess I'll stay in, um, hoping that Garfunkel can actually take this thing down, because if it doesn't, I'm going to be afraid. The wind is finally with us. It's level 13, which is... What the fuck? Hacks? P Pidgey evolves at, like, level 18. That's not even fair. Come on. You gotta hack your Pokemon. Stupid. Two flinches in a row. Oh my god. Yes, go. Go, Garfunkel. Four! Four flinches. Four flinches. Oh my gosh. 
Okay, we got four flinches in a row. Holy shit. Um, and we're faster, so I'm just gonna bite. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. Go freaking Garfunkel. Oh man, I would have died. I swear, I would have died. That was not cool. Level 15, and we've... Ooh, that was fast. Okay, I understand. I'll bow out gracefully. You better, bitch. Ooh, my dad's... Okay, so your dad cheated, not you. Oh, gosh. Must have been in uh, Team Rocket. So we finally got our first badge. Ah, oh, I, th I could have sworn there'd be a death by now. All right, so level Pokemon, tw uh, level 20 Pokemon <laughs> will start to obey you, and it lets you use Rock Smash anytime out of battle. And we get Team 51. It's probably like a flying-type move, which you can't even use. What is it? Roost. It's fucking retarded. Okay, so Roost. Roost is a really cool move, but the only thing is I don't have a flying-type yet. And I think that's kind of stupid. Um, uh-oh, uh-oh, Professor Elm's calling me. Hello, Pluto, we've discovered something. Oh, man, I want you to carry that egg. Assistant, I think you got the wrong number, but, uh, I'll go ahead and, uh, I'll go ahead and steal an egg. Why not? Oh, Pluto, isn't it? Oh, from your mom. It's a repel, thank you, I think. Okay, whatever. Um... Long time no see, Pluto. I've been waiting for you. This is for Professor Elm. <laughs> he doesn't even know what Pluto looks like. Oh, gosh. After you left, Elm received a phone call. I have no idea what they were talking about, but after a while, I can't think of anyone more suited than Pluto. Well, this Pluto guy seems great, but uh, I think you definitely got the wrong guy. Alright, so let's... Where are we going here? Hey, lady. What's up? Me, oh my. That egg must be... I see. So it was handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm, then from Professor Elm to you. Now I get it. That egg is truly an important egg. Do take care of it for me. Is that understood? No. I'm counting on you. Thanks, I think. Cool. So, uh, we just got an egg. We'll be able to hatch that egg uh, sometime soon. Let's check him out. Let's see. Received from Mr. Pokemon. It appears to move occasionally. It may be close to hatching. Um, yeah. Okay. So we're going to take this egg and we're going to hatch it. Um, if you guys want me to kind of like switch it up and not give myself a Togepi, but give me something like a Team Rocket member would have, like a coughing, l leave a comment and just tell me what if I should mess with the with the stuff with the things. So, this is a new route down here. Uh, wait up, what's the hurry? You have some good Pokemon there. It must be from the training you gave them around Violet City. Yeah, that must be it. I mean, their original trainers didn't, you know, train them any anything like that. The training at the gym must have been ex especially helpful. As a souvenir from Violet City, take this. It increases the power of grass-type moves. We got the Miracle Seed, and we can give this item to... Um... Mandrake, actually. So I'm actually going to give it to Mandrake. And... Onwards! Um, so the first trainer on this route that I battle, um, I'm going to be able to steal their last Pokemon. Ooh, Ekans! I may be able to get an Ekans, that'd be cool. Um, oh, I forgot to heal! I forgot to heal! Oh, thank God I have run away too. Um, but... I do have a few potions, and since I'm not in battle, I can finally use these things. Okay, that'll be enough. Alright, so there's a trainer there, but I could go around him and try to battle someone else for an even better Pokemon. So. There's a Mary here, and I'm sending out Garfunkel just because... Why not take this thing down? It's level 6, it's going to give me some good EXP. And, ooh, so close, and it flinched, ha. Uh, I'm just going to use a quick attack, hoping that I, that I don't get to paralyze here. No, I don't, we're good. So let's uh, carry on our wayward son, and uh, just go around that guy. I'm going to go around her too, because she looks like she'd 
she's facing a rock. She may be having some rock type Pokemon. I don't want any rock type Pokemon. Now the cool thing about here is there are a few fishermen here. That's neat. Okay, whatever. Um, oh gosh, I think one of these has like a level 15, if my memory serves correct. So I'm just, I'm gonna make sure, and I'm gonna go <laughs> to the Pokemon Center. I'll be right back. Okay, I am all healed up, and I am ready to uh, face one of these trainers. I'm hoping one of them has a Magikarp, because I'll be able to catch a Magikarp if that is true. So, Eeny, Meeny, Miny, you. A Pokemon, freshly caught. Yes. Delicious. Okay, he's got two Pokemon. He's got... Oh, I want one of those! I want one of those! Holy crap, I want one of those! That's an instant water type. Oh my gosh. But I can't catch this one, so I'm just gonna bite it. Oh man, I want one. I want one so badly. Even though it just has water sport. Oh gosh. That would be so cool. I want a water type. Please, 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 please. What's your second one? Watch, watch his second one be a magic card. Just watch. Just watch. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. And... <gasps> Polymag! No, I'm gonna keep battling. I'm gonna keep battling. Holy crap, yes. Um... I'm not gonna try to attack it, because I don't want... Critical hits just hate me in this game. So I'm gonna use a lure ball. Lure ball. And be able to catch this polywag, hopefully. One. Oh, come on. This is not gonna turn into Megatron. I'm not going to throw 99 Ultra Balls at you. Oh, gosh. Okay, let me get myself another Lure Ball. Lure Ball. However you say it. I don't know how you say Lur. Lur, Lur, Lur. A Lur, Lur, Lur. And, woo! Cop Polywag. Sweet. Okay. Polywag's data was added to the Pokedex. The direction of its belly spiral differs by area. The equator is thought to have an effect on this. That's that's actually kind of cool. Give a nickname. Yes, I'm going to nickname him. Um, let's go. Polywag. Pa. Polly. Polywag. Polly. Swag. Polly swag. Yeah. It's Bacon, Yeah. Poliswag. Woo, let's check this Poliswag out. See what, uh, see what all the business is up to. It's a naive nature, and it's proud of its power. Um, that means up speed, down special defense. Oh, well that sucks. Oh, but it has damp, which prevents self-destructing, which is always great. I mean... In Nuzlocke's, you have no idea how often you're going to need a polyswag to go against your uh, your people who are just exploding everywhere. So, uh, he knows Water Sport Bubble and Hypnosis. That's okay, I guess. Uh, Bellsprout knows Vine Whip. Got String Tackle, String Shot, Bite Pursuit, Quick Attack, and Focus Energy. So, uh, I think my time's just about up. But, um... I like this song, so I'm gonna play it while I uh, while I beat the crap out of this guy right here with 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 a bell sprout, yeah, yeah. So without without further ado, well, uh, I guess I w I would like to present "It's Becca" by uh, Man and a Mexican. <laughs> It's Take 
it's